if you do get it, and it's upwards of 99%, it's, you know, even if you're over 70, it's survival rate of 94.5%. Uh, I don't know if, how many of y'all heard of a fellow named John MacArthur, he's a pastor of uh, yeah. Grace Community Church in LA. When it came out from the CDC, they had about 180,000 deaths at the time, but only 9,200 of them, they were sure from COVID, because everybody else had an average of 2.6 comorbidities, so they might have died with it, but we can't prove they died from it. At that point, John MacArthur basically said, we've been scammed. He said there is no pandemic. I mean, yeah, H1N1. A state of emergency that's continued for how many months now? Yeah, state of emergency continues, yeah. H1N1, um, back in 09, we had over 12,000 deaths from that. We've had fewer than 10,000 from this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And yet, we're closing down people's businesses. And uh, to his credit, the governor said, unlike some other states, we can't really tell churches what to do. You have the freedom of religion, but we do have guidelines. We get pretty strong suggestions. And, and that's great. I'm trying to call balls and strikes when I do my afternoon talk show on News Radio 1029 KRN. I think the governor's right on something. I'll say it. I think he's wrong on something. I'll say it. And, and that goes for any of them. Like when our Attorney General Leslie Rutledge recently said George Floyd was killed simply because he was black. I'm like, are you kidding me? I mean, now that the medical examiner's report that they hid for three months came of, out, said he was a fentanyl over, overdose, so you're going to retract that. And her spokesperson said, well, I would just recommend you look at her earlier statements. Oh, her statements when we all thought he was murdered? Oh, great. Yeah. Anyway, but I'm getting off the subject. So I'm wondering if the day after President Trump's landslide re-election, I'm wondering if maybe November 4th he'll decide to fire Anthony Fauci, just like he fired Jeff Sessions the day after the 2018 elections, and then we get back to normal. Yeah. Because it's all political. Yeah. Right. I mean, uh, Fauci himself. Fauci himself is getting ready to do some kind of uh, public deal, uh, public appearance with Hillary Clinton and. Uh, and a Black Lives Matter organizer, and he's gone all new Green Deal, and, oh, we've got to get rid of carbon, and, uh... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, Fauci the rock star, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so, um, I've done an informal poll of all the voices in my head, and they all agree this, this is jacked up. Whereas my peeps would say it's whack. Um, so I, uh, I really appreciate you having the idea to do the Unmasked Arkansas peaceful protest in front of the governor's mansion. I appreciate the fact that uh, several state patrol cars have been by. We just kind of waved at them. They waved at us. Mm -hmm. I want to say thank you uh, to Mayor Scott and uh, and Chief Keith Humphrey for once in my life um, for not coming by and hassling us, which would have kind of looked unusual since Black Lives Matter protesters were here a couple of nights ago making a lot of noise. Right. Making a lot of noise. Wake up, Asa! As if the governor of Arkansas somehow it had something to do with a grand jury investigation <laughs> in <laughs> Kentucky. I couldn't quite make the connection there. But then again, then again, when they had the protesters blocking the Walmarts on a yeah. Sunday afternoon mm -hmm. a couple of months ago, yep. and some of them were talking about defunding Walmart, <laughs> it's almost as if, uh, y'all might want to move back, I think they want to get by. It's almost as if they didn't understand how Walmart was funded. <laughs> See. Look, I'm not the sharpest knife in the firmament. I'm not the brightest bulb in the drawer, but I thought Walmart was funded when people actually go there and, uh, what do you call it? Um, buy stuff. Buy stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh oh, uh oh, here about like that. like some kind of government agency. <laughs> so, 